Hi, everyone. Uh, this is Ron Weigel, Business Development Manager, Aerospace for the Americas uh, for Quaker Houghton. Welcome to Aeromat and the Lunch and Learn session. Uh, today, we're going to be talking about improving productivity with advanced metalworking fluids and remote monitoring in Industry 4.0. Next, I'd like to show you a corporate video, Quaker Houghton, show you a little bit about who we call on as far as industries and the products that we supply within those industries. We are Quaker Houghton, the global leader in industrial process fluids, united around a shared vision to make our customers more efficient, more innovative, more successful. Quaker Houghton customers make the global economy move, prosper, and grow. Our customers produce steel, aluminum, cars. They make aircraft, machinery, industrial parts, and much, much more. We take on our customers' challenges as our own, bringing the right combination of science, engineering, and business savvy so they can meet the future fully confident that their operations will perform even more effectively. If it's made of metal, if it's rolled, cut, drawn, or cast, Quaker Houghton is there. Advancing safety and sustainability, optimizing processes, reducing costs, driving progress together for our customers in our labs, plants, and offices in more than 25 countries, helping our customers to achieve their most ambitious goals together. One company moving forward together. Quaker Houghton forward together. So here at Quaker Houghton, we're a global leader in industrial process fluids. We continually improve and innovate so our customers can stay ahead of the changing world. If it's made of metal, if it's rolled, if it's cut, drawn or cast, Quaker Houghton is there optimizing processes, reducing costs, advancing safety and sustainability in driving progress. We take our customers' challenges as our own, bringing the right combination of science, engineering, business savvy so they can meet future fully confident that their operations will run even more efficiently, even more effectively, whatever comes first. Quaker Houghton, a leading global supplier of industrial process fluids. We're located in Pennsylvania, USA. We've got 15,000 customers, 4,000 employees, 1.6 billion in sales. And we're serving 115 countries served all around the world. $42 million we spend in R&D expenditure and we manufacture in over 35 locations. So our strategic markets uh, today, uh, we're gonna really specify on aerospace and defense, but we also do metal finishing. We're in steel, aluminum, mining, tube and pipe, industrial, offshore, transportation components. Uh, metal containers, rod and wire, and transportation OEM. So we do have a global reach, uh, local commitment, uh, 35 manufacturing facilities around the world globally, 35 R&D technology centers to support uh, our sales force in manufacturing plants and over seven, 70 offices. So partnering with some of the world's most advanced and specialized companies. We have both aerospace companies on here and automotive companies and steel companies, but a few there that you'll recognize, Boeing, Raytheon, and Rolls-Royce for this particular conference are, are some of the 15,000 customers that uh, we do business with um, on a global basis. So innovations that prepare customers for the future I'd like to pick out two or three here. Uh, Cosmoline, I think, is a well-known rust preventative uh, protection. Uh, it won the Ben Franklin Award clear back in 1865. So it's still used today. Um, we still have to clean it off. Uh, some of the machines coming in from overseas today in the aerospace market. So another product that uh, 
you might be familiar with or using your plants in 1954, we were the inventor of uh, the first fire resistant hydraulic fluids. And then in 1997, we launched a Hokut 795 metal removing fluid, well known for its biostability performance and, and really changed the industry. And as we continue today, um, to continue to come out with innovative products uh, in the past and well into the future. We spend 2.8% of our revenue on R&D investment, and we look to deliver even better and more efficient and effective solutions for our customers. A Little bit about our product offering serving the aerospace industry. Quaker Houghton, a leading global supplier to the aerospace industry, $75 million of global aerospace customer business, extensive references, long-term supplier partnerships with all major manufacturers. And we have over 100 uh, aerospace approvals within our product offering. New innovation technologies meeting demands of challenging and legislation and materials. Customer recognition, We've been recognized uh, for a Boeing Performance Excellence Award uh, over the years. And uh, that means a lot to us with all our suppliers to, to win these awards. Understanding your challenges with Quaker Houghton products and our dedicated industry experts, you can identify product and service solutions to reduce your total cost. Uh, TCO Savings is a, is a uh, a big uh, word that we use a lot within the industry, total cost savings within your organization or your operation. A lot of times it's not uh, getting a cheaper price uh, product to reduce costs, but to look at the total cost of your operation. Sometimes that will take a more price driven, more expensive price product but in your, overall top, uh, in your overall cost savings, it will reduce your cost. So we look to increase productivity and maximize throughput and reduce downtime and improve safety and environmental performance, reduce waste, energy, and water consumption. So um, with our sales force being, um, um, have so much experience within the industry, um, a lot of our people have 20 some years, 30 some years experience within the industry. And it really helps um, when they go in and reduce um, the particular customer's total cost of operation. So a little bit about our product portfolio in the aerospace uh, cleaners, corrosion preventatives. We talked about Cosmoline being one of those products that is used um, to maybe uh, keep the machine from rusting on transportation. Along with that, maybe parts go on the shelf um, for a period of time and have to be stored. Uh, so corrosion preventatives are used then. Uh, die cast fluids along with die cast, uh, fire resistant hydraulic fluids are used within that industry. Forging fluids, industrial lubes and greases. Um, with the industrial lubes, you're talking about whey oils, maybe hydraulic oils that are used in machines, uh, greases also. So we kind of match that up too to make sure that uh, you're using the correct fluids within those machines. Uh, neat cutting oils, um, they'd be used in gear grinding or different applications within the plant. Peelable coatings, soluble uh, metal removal fluids, we'll talk about a few of those, and quenching. So aerospace coolant common issues. These are some of the common issues that uh, when we've talked to customers or potential customers uh, that they recognize that maybe they have an issue with or having a particular problem within a plant. Within that uh, new EHS regulations, compliance and supply chain disruption risk, reach and other regional regulations, uh, the harmonization of uh, GHS, that we've all gone through. Secondary and mean skin rash, they may be having water consumption reduction, which is along with the ISO 14,000. Um, another issue, maintenance issue. 
uh, decreased total cost. So along that line, we get involved with solution stability, some maintenance that could involve the equipment, uh, could be as simple as far as skimmer or basically equipment to uh, get the oil off the product, machine cleanliness, Houghton's products, Quaker Houghton's products are, are known for, and machine uh, tool rust and plastic degradation. So new machining challenges help increase productivity. Super alloys as far as ink canal, titanium and aluminum alloys, drilling by metals, carbon fiber composites, also speed, speed machining. That's 20,000 plus RPMs and high pressure. Uh, technical challenge, uh, solve specific technical issues, staining of aluminum alloys you might have, or meeting multiple OEM requirements as we'll talk about uh, some of the approvals and in, in slides coming up um, that might be of interest to uh, customers or parts difficult to degrease. Sometimes after they get a uh, machine, they move into uh, a different process within the plants and getting some of these oils off could be a challenge. So some of the metalworking uh, soluble uh, fluids that we'll talk about, one of them is whole cut 4260. Uh, we'd like to recognize this one for medium and heavy duty machining applications, including high speed machining of a wide range of aerospace materials. So 4260 is a, a, uh, a newer product within our Quaker Houghton portfolio and is becoming more and more popular within the industry. Lower operating uh, concentrations, you can reduce consumption with it. Excellent stability, extended sump life, excellent cleanliness of machines and parts produced, and significant reduced risk of staining and corrosion. So some of the customer references, uh, we've reduced consumption by 25% and improved the tool life at GKN. Uh, no biocide used for 12 months at uh, UTC Aerospace. And this pr product is particularly unique, uh, constant pH of 9.2, giving a two-year sump life at a customer. Uh, reduced coolant consumption by 30% at Gardner Aerospace. The next product, Cold Cut 4940, is a recent product. We uh, received Boeing approval, BCAAC. Uh, 5008 for usage areas one through seven. So whole cut 4940 is a versatile metal removing fluid. And it's recommended for high duty machining on a wide variety of aerospace materials from fuselage to aluminum parts to complex titanium ink canal engine parts. Excellent corrosion protection inhibits aluminum staining and can be used for sensitive alloys, especially that 7000 series. Suitable for high and ultra speed machining. Uh, again, that's 20,000 plus RPM that we've identified and it's officially approved by Airbus, Boeing, Bombardier, Strafon, uh, Pratt Whitney, Rolls-Royce and many other OEMs. And this is important uh, for these approvals to get as many as you can on there because it's one thing to have the OEM, it's another thing, the second and third tier suppliers within the aerospace industry 60 to 70% of the work is done through them. So instead of changing out uh, for a different uh, a coolant for a specific OEM, by having the multiple approvals, this gives the, the customer uh, the flexibility of doing multiple OEM works uh, within their facility. So Customer references increased titanium machining uh, with 4940 by 150%. 40% production uh, increase increased the feed rates and the cycle time, 60, 76 reduction in tool costs and 85% reduction in annual coolant costs from reduced concentration required. Hull cut 795B, another metal working fluid soluble product is the number one coolant used in the aerospace application. It's versatile, heavy duty, chlorine free, soluble metal removing fluid formula to machine aerospace grade aluminums, titanium hassaloy, ink canal, stainless steel, 
super alloys and composites. It's approved by 15 aerospace manufacturers. So some of the customer reference with this particular product is 60% reduction in titanium machining coolant costs through improved biostability and efficiency, 50% defect reduction, uh, eliminated e expensive post work, and 400% increase in tap life on aluminum parts. 66% increase in aluminum part productivity with 46 decrease in tooling cost. 25% increase in tool life machining of titanium. So heat treatment is the next uh, Quaker Houghton uh, product we'd like to talk about. So Quaker Houghton is the uh, global leader in heat treating fluids uh, within the aerospace industry, approved cold quenching oils, polymer quenchant, and heat treat salts. So the first couple I'd like to talk about is AquaQuench 260 and 251. Uh, they're the best in class polymer quenchants, compliant with aerospace material standard AMS 3025C type one and two, approved by leading aerospace manufacturers, including Boeing and Rolls-Royce. The next products, how to quench G and K, uh, they're also the best in class uh, cold quenching oils, and they have a BAC approval also for those two. Uh, within our salts, the uh, draw temp 275 and draw temp 430, uh, best in class again, heat treat salts uh, with the approval of AMS 2821 and the BAC approval. Neat cutting oils. Uh, years of experience enable us to develop a comp uh, comprehensive line of quality neat cutting oils for the aerospace. Uh, Macron 805. M5 veg and Macron 805 M10 veg are basically synthetic esters, renewable sources that show a high oxidation stability. And they're very good with uh, components, paint, and their silt material used in hydraulic oils, your whey oils, your hydraulic oils used in machinery. They're free from chlorine, active sulfur, heavy metals like zinc, and mineral oil. And we have approvals with those also. It's also ANCA approval for aerospace grinding. Another product within the neat cutting oil line is Macron 2429S8. It's also synthetic esters and show a high level of oxidation stability. It's also uh, compatible with sealed material and paint in hydraulic oils and it's free of chlorine, active sulfur, and zinc and mineral oil. And we have approvals with that, as you can see, and also approved the ANAC approval for aerospace grinding. Product approvals, more than 100 industry approvals include, including these. So these are the, the metal working fluids that we talked about, 795B, 4940, and 4260. And with the quenching, over there, Aqua Quench uh, 251 and 260. As you can see, um, with Boeing, Airbus, Pratt Whitney, Rolls Royce, Bombardier, and Surfan, uh, these products uh, meet the OEM approvals and, and really help uh, the second, third tier suppliers be flexible on the type of work that they can do as far as machining parts for the aerospace industry. So Quaker Houghton serving the aerospace industry, a dedicated global aerospace, aerospace team supporting customers to achieve your productivity, EHS and, and profitability targets, relationship with all key OEMs and tier ones, excellent understanding of the approval process and contacts to support our customers. Um, unrivaled references and experience to provide fluids, equipment, and services and technical solutions to the aerospace customers globally. This is basically what I get involved with in my part as being business development manager, uh, supporting the OEM and two one suppliers, tier one suppliers. So industry 4.0, serving the aerospace industry. So fluid intelligence within our company is a complete package that provides engineer solution 
through metal processing and combination of four core offerings, expertise, service, equipment, and fluids. And it defines our comprehensive service offering, enables you to run your machines at peak performance using our experience and expertise, our advanced product portfolio that we've discussed, support services, and manufacturing equipment. And if you look at the illustration to the right, the customer is in the center, and then whatever uh, may apply as far as uh, problem solvers when they go in there, it may have to do with adding some equipment or it may be fluids, but we use our expertise and offer a service to come up with a, a solution uh, to improve your productivity in a strategic uh, situation within our partnership within our customers. So QH digital compatibility. Uh, QH fluid trend is one of the um, uh, particular equipment that is uh, used within Quaker Houghton. So within that QH fluid control, uh, fluid clean, fluid mix, fluid top off and fluid worker within the equipment. And then if you look over at the monitoring service, different sensor technology, process lines, fluid systems on the, we use uh, Quaker Houghton Global Laboratories to support all this. The customer experience uh, portal, uh, live consumption and cost data. We'll show you a couple of the reports in, in slides coming up and advanced reporting, kind of customized uh, specifically to individual customers. And EHS regulatory compliance there, you've got REACH and SDS is on there. And then the mobile data application with the uh, QR code scanning and automated data transfer, two-way communication, remote maintenance, remote adjustments. So gives you a little bit of uh, our capability as far as QH fluid trend. So innovative equipment roadmap, you've got production there, innovative equipment, monitoring and automation equipment there, and then the QH fluid trend and customer experience dashboard. And I think the next slide, it'll show you what one of those reports look like database decision, production efficiency, and cost savings, TCO savings. Digital capability extended to standard scope of activity. So if you look at fluid management operations, it could include a number of things there um, around the outside of uh, the circle. Swarf processing management, water treatment, we're heavily involved with with our customers, air filtration, waste management, um, storage and equipment, EHS compliance, uh, filter management, fluid recycling, advanced chemical management, additional services, fluid technology and coolant system design, and SWARF processing and management. So QH Fluid Trend is developed to support uh, QH Fluid Care and service operations. This system is fully automated and uses uh, the users to identify both performance and cost trend for any given machine or system immediately. Designed for optimum fluid and lubrication management, all analytical results from each machine test are automatically recorded and properly displayed on, on QH Fluid Trend. The customer portal displays the condition of fluids at any time, enable tends to display uh, reports and generally instantly. Our custom made data logger scans QR codes at the point of application test results are immediately uploaded. So not only is this for the fluid, but this is for the lubricants that are used within that machine also um, to keep you updated and, and to give you your data points needed in, you know, uh, in operation of your plants. So this is uh, the database reporting that I talked about earlier. So you can customize this however you want to. Um, the number of machines by average sump life, um, as you see on the first one, the number of machines by sump life, uh, average sump life, uh, current year, 
uh, versus previous year by site, um, concentration um, specific in and out by site. If you look at that, um, you know, you don't want to run too lean on your metal working fluid. You don't want to run too high um, and use more coolant than you actually have to. So in specification of current year and previous year by site, um, it can give you that data point also. So very customized to a particular need of a, a particular plant and customer. Um, they can do a lot with this in customizing it for your particular situation. So the complete solution for metal uh, processing expertise, we talked a little bit about environmental health and safety, um, consulting and training, technical application support uh, with our strategic partners and fluid intelligence academy. So as far as the fluids go, rolling, forming, forging, die casting, metal removal, heat treat, degreasing, cleaning, metal protecting, fire resistant, and general lubrication. So equipment, uh, storage, mixing, and distribution, condition monitoring and, and control. Uh, that's what we talked a little bit about the QH fluid trend. Fluid maintenance and optimization, environmental health and safety, cost recovery, wastewater treatment, and some of the services, uh, laboratory testing, uh, technical services, engineering services, QH fluid trend, performance monitoring software, Fluid care are on-site engineers um, that uh, manage the chemicals uh, within the individual plants. Uh, we have global customers that we do that in all over the all over the world. And QH fluid support visiting service engineers. So a couple of uh, examples: uh, GKN Aerospace uh, Service Solutions. Uh, they've been a customer since two thousand eight. They previously were a basic coolant management uh, with a competitor. They had uh, four on-site um, contract scope. The site teams there, we've increased it uh, to 16 within two years. Um, products added, spill kits, kits, uh, filters, 24-7 operation running, SWARF management contract added in 2000 and 16 and now worth uh, 1.4 million euros. Solution approach, 8% uh, annual spend delivered as guaranteed savings target. And that differs uh, no matter uh, what company that you're dealing with, everybody's unique and different as far as their target goes. Additional equipment line sold. as part of the process improvement initiatives and new SWARF processing equipment initiative. Another example of uh, one of our customers, Rolls-Royce, uh, Quaker Houghton, is the sole uh, fluid management provider for all UK locations. So they have 13 fully serviced locations there, 38 fluid care technicians uh, based on the Rolls-Royce sites. Um, that's Quaker Houghton fluid care people within that plant managing the chemicals and the processes within those plants dedicated management and technical specialists ensure full compliance with RPS 917 and HSE guidance delivered a 5% cost savings year over year since 2008, which is hard to do. That's 13 straight years of delivering the cost savings. We are tier one lubricant uh, supplier to Rolls-Royce Group. We purchase all and manage all lubricant related products in 15 UK locations. 500 tier two products and managing 20 tier two suppliers with over 2 million euros spent. Again, another example, uh, Rolls-Royce, a fan and uh, turbine uh, disc Washington facility in the UK, a full turnkey equipment solution project involving supply, insulation and commissioning of coolant mixing and distribution center uh, system, auto Automatic uh, coolant top-off units, bulk holding tanks and drum racking, and vacuum evaporation system for waste treatment. The project was part of a five-year fluid management agreement incorporating three full-time QH fluid care personnel. So as you can see from all three of these examples that uh, we just showed, um, 
something different for each customer. Nothing's the same. Everybody is unique of what they're wanting and, and what we can offer to you. So I thank you today uh, for allowing me to show you a little bit about Quaker Houghton, especially if you uh, hadn't heard of us in the past. But I appreciate it, and thank you very much. Okay, any uh, questions? I guess you can type it in now into the q and I'd be more than happy to uh, address those if anybody has any. I thank you for uh, listening to our presentation um, for Aramat 2021. Okay, if there's no questions, you can visit us at our booth at Quaker Houghton, and uh, we'd be more than happy to uh, answer any questions that you may have uh, from our pre presentation or, or the company. Thanks again, and uh, I appreciate you taking the time and uh, listening to it.